the International Space Station may continue to operate through 2030. The administrator of NASA, Bill Nelson, made the announcement on 31st December 2021, expressing the Biden-Harris administration's commitment to make that happen. US works alongside its partners, European Space Agency, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency, Canadian Space Agency and Russia State Space Corporation to sustain operations of the orbiting laboratory. Besides an approval from its international partners, US will need funding for ISS to be sanctioned by the Congress. Currently, the funding is approved only through 2024. The ISS costs about a third of NASA's annual human spaceflight budget. ISS was launched up in low Earth orbit in installments. The first piece went up on a Russian rocket in 1998. Further parts continued to be added to the station until it was set to be finished in 2011. However, ISS had become ready to receive astronauts only two years after its first launch in 1998. The first crew therefore arrived on 2nd November 2000. Since then, the orbital outpost has hosted more than 3,000 research investigations from over 4,200 researchers across the world. The year 2020 marked a significant personal milestone for ISS after having hosted 20 years of continuous human presence. Activities on board the ISS have helped us learn how humans can safely live in microgravity, develop a better understanding of planet Earth, mark advancements in medicine, test technologies in order to explore further out in space and stimulate an emerging low-Earth orbit economy. After having served the planet for over two decades, ISS was looking at a 2024 wind down with a possible extension time frame of four years. However, it appears now that the ISS will be kept in orbit until the year 2030.